You know, to hear a kid tell you what he got for Christmas or she got for Christmas, they have, they don't even take a break. <laughs> I mean, it's ridiculous. I got this. And I got a. I got a PlayStation. I got an Xbox. I've got. I've got some sunglasses. I got some new blue jeans. I got some Journey Cologne. I've got a new toboggan. I've got a new shoes. I. I got some candy. I got some candy corn. I got all kinds of stuff. You would. I got a new dress. I got new stockings. I got some new jewelry. I got some new Harrod stitches. I got all kinds of stuff. You wouldn't believe it. I got fake glasses, real glasses. Dark glasses, sunglasses, beach glasses, winter glasses, snow glasses, ski glasses. I've got all kinds of stuff. I got stocking stuffers. I got an apple. Got orange. Got pecan. Got some cotton candy. I got some peppermints. I got all kinds of stuff, and I'm real happy. <laughs> now that was what was under that tree. I went to Grandma's house. I got some socks, <laughs> underwear. <laughs> then I went to my other Grandma's house. I got some soap. <laughs> you know, people people don't really know what you got till they get around you. That's right. You know, we we're traditionally known as as America that we celebrate Christmas. We know it's man oriented and all that good stuff. I'm going to blow it for the kids. But we know man created Christmas. Man didn't create God. And God created Christ. And we, we don't mind celebrating His birth. We celebrate that. Amen? Amen? But so many times, and we've heard it as it's a common rhetoric, well, Christmas is over, and, you know, we celebrate it once a year. But I want to maybe pin a thought in your mind that what I got for Christmas, it won't run out. That what I got for Christmas is from everlasting to everlasting. Somebody touch your neighbor and say, he's got you. <laughs> 